What is up you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Do As I Say, Nor As I Do, although don't do as I say because I'm drunk and I have no idea what I'm doing. I am so drunk right now, I've had at least half a can of coke, like it's fully gone to my head. So yeah, not drunk today, just fed up my face. I miss my brow appointments, I miss my lash appointments, I miss my nose waxing appointments. I am just getting hairier and hairier as the days go by, so today I am going to be fixing that and potentially fucking up my face in the process, but that's fine. I might be mildly disfigured by the end of this video, but the goal is to be hair free and I'm gonna make that happen. So today I'm gonna be waxing my nostrils, I'm gonna be tinting my lashes, I'm gonna be tinting my brows, although I think this stuff might be out of date, but I'm still gonna use it anyway. And then I also have this wax pen here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I'm just gonna like wax various sections of my face. And hopefully, I was gonna say hopefully I look like a supermodel by the end of it, but to be honest, if I have a face left, at the end of this video, then that's good enough for me. So yeah, if you'd like to watch me fuck up my face, giving zero fucks, drinking some zero coke, uh, please stay tuned. So obviously, we've got to get the macro camera involved for this one and ignore my eyebrows, they need plucking so badly, but I thought I would tint them before I plucked them just in case it like picks up any extra hairs. Yeah, so I think I'll start with that. So I have the Miley eyebrow and lash tint and I've got the activator to go with it in this little glass dish. I've used this multiple times before. I've forgotten how to use it because I haven't done it in a while because normally I get soaked to do my brows. But yeah, I think I've got this in like a dark brown. I've got black as well, but no. Should probably get some instructions on how to use this thing. So first of all, it says to cleanse my brows. I don't have any makeup or anything at the moment, which is why it looks so gorgeous. <laughs> Look at me, wow. Can you tell I'm just like done with today? Like. I've been done with today since I woke up and I wasn't gonna film and then I just thought, I want to be beautiful. I don't know if I'll achieve it today, but I want to be beautiful. And so I thought, you know what? Just sit down and film. Just gonna cleanse my bushy old brows. So as you guys can see, I do have microblading in my brows here. My brows are naturally pretty dark, but I just kind of want to tint them to make them look a little bit more full because I do have some blonde bits around here. Okay, so it's just to wipe through my brows. Done. Then it says, pierce tube nozzle with an inverted cap. This is too much information already. Okay, it then says, squeeze like a centimeter of this into the jar. Just like that. This has definitely gone off. I'm, I'm still gonna use it. I'm still gonna use it, but I'm just gonna, why is it foamy? Shall I mix a tiny bit of black in there? <laughs> Maybe I will. I think I will. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna mix a little bit of black in there. Kind of like, that's definitely more than a centimeter, but three parts black. No, three parts brown, one part black. That should be fine, isn't it? It should be fine. I just feel like that's not how it's supposed to look. Hmm. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's not like, it's not like it's on my face. It then says, add the brow and lash tint activator drop by drop until a creamy consistency is reached and then stir it. Okay. I'm gonna add a few more drops than I probably should right now because I got a lot in here. I mean, it's a cream anyway, so I don't really understand what they want me to get from this, really. Is that creamy enough? Why does it look purple? It doesn't smell of anything. Let's add a bit more. It then says to apply petroleum jelly, like Vaseline kind of stuff. I don't have any around me right now. I might just get a little bit of moisturizer and just kind of put that around my brows. Like just here. That should work, shouldn't it? That should be fine. Suddenly, a huge allergic reaction between this moisturizer and the brow stuff. It says, apply tint to eyebrows with a mascara wand, only leave the tint on 45 to 60 seconds. Oh my God, are you joking me? I literally just put on these brand new lovely nails and it's stained them already. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna slap this on, I think. What could go wrong? Honestly, I've just lost the will to live at this point, so I'm just gonna go straight through them. How do you expect me to apply this and take it off within the 45 seconds? Oh, that was a big bit. Okay, so I'm just gonna brush these through, make sure that, honestly, what is that? Eh. I just wanna catch these hairs up here. Okay, I'm gonna do the other one. And then this one. Oh, they look nice, cool. I wanna keep it on for a little bit longer. That might be a mistake, but mistakes are just lessons in, I don't know, I'm trying to think of some kind of live, laugh, love quote, I don't know. Okay, I don't have a cotton pad, but I do have my trusty wipes, so. Da, 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 da. Does that do much? I'm really not sure if it did or not. 
Did that do anything? Uh, I might leave it on longer, you know. That's it, get it on there, lads. I can't get over how cute I look right now. I might actually get my brows microbladed like this. I just think, I just think it looks nice, you know? Uh, okay, what can I do while I wait? <sighs> what is this? So then I have the Miley Precision Wax Pen with sunflower oil. It says face and body, no need to heat, ideal for touch-ups. Ready to use formula, twist up pen with fine nozzle. I guess I just like put it wherever I want it and then just rip it off like a normal wax thing. Um, I mean, I could read the instructions. I'll look over them quickly. Uh, mm, do not use on varicose veins. Okay, I'll tell you what, I've started to get varicose veins and I'm not happy about it. I say that as I'm sitting here with my legs crossed like a child. Warm it by placing it in hot water. You told me I didn't have to warm it, you little sneaky snakes. Maybe I'll take this off my brows now because it has been like five times longer than what I'm supposed to have it on for. Who can say that's better, I think. Or is that too dark? Oh my God, I, it might be too dark. I'm just gonna like fully rub through them. It worked, it's all good. You don't need to follow the instructions. You should, but I'm not going to. Oh yes, 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 that actually did a really good job. I'm buzzing about that. I'm just gonna brush them through, but yeah, that did a good job and that was hella quick. I might even put some more up here. Yeah, why not? Do, do, do. I just want to kind of like fill in the little gap that I've got with my microblading was. Just like, just fill it in a touch, you know? And like this bit here, get it right in there. It doesn't stain the skin either. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna wax it off in a minute. Shall I try, wait a minute. Okay, my hairs on my top lip aren't actually very long now, but I don't know, it could be fun. Okay, let's try this again. This stuff works so good. I would use it on my lashes. I have used it on my lash before. It does work really, really well, but I do just want to try this out. Let's now just quickly remove my upper lip stuff. Ah, oh, it didn't really do much. Just kind of gave me a little bit of a five o'clock shadow. Um, let's try this stuff. Okay, so it just screws up like a little lip gloss. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna put that on my lip. Oh my God. I usually shave my mustache, like when I shave my face, but I've had this laying around for a while, and so I just thought, you know what? Steph's sexy salon, where we live, laugh, and love. Hello everyone, welcome to Steph's sexy salon. I'm Steph, and I'm sexy, and I can make you sexy as well. So then I have to take one of these sheets. I think I've ever really waxed my own lip before. Which way does it go? Does it matter? Uh, Mm, okay, I'm just gonna leave it there for a second. I think that's what you're supposed to do. I always read user instructions before using the product. No. Place a strip over the wax. Put your skin tight in one hand, then pull the strip in the opposite direction. Okay, are we ready? Three, two. Oh, I can't do it, I can't do it. Ollie, Ollie, Ollie! I'm gonna get Ollie to do it. Please, come here. I would like you to rip it off for me. Which way? Let's see, okay, start on that side. Quickly. Yeah, let, but trying to make sure that you can see it with the macro as well, so we can get the full effect. Okay, wait, one. Ready? Mm. Oh. It did nothing! Um. No, don't stick it to my head! Don't stick it to my head! Stick it to my face. Fucking up my face, part two. Let's try this again. I put a little bit less on my lip. Oh! Still nothing. Yep, absolutely nothing. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of moisturizer over the top just cause I don't really know what else to do, in all honesty. Just put a bit of moisturizer on it. Just needs to like wet paper towel it, like how they did at school. Mm. Hey boys, natural beauty over here. Okay, so that didn't work. I just have like a red lip now. But what if I, what if I put it in between my brows? I feel like I don't need as much product as I maybe thought. So I'm just gonna, da, 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 just like that maybe. Let's try this. I literally know Sophie's gonna watch this video and be like, what are you doing to your face? My face, my rules, bitch. Ready? If first you don't succeed. Let's try it again. Oh, I'm not very good at this, am I? I've gotta say, I think my brows 
do actually look better. Like they do just look a little bit more full. Like that brow is looking pretty good. So next, I thought it would be a good idea to wax my nostrils. I've had this done before. I am a hairy bitch. And I know I could trim my nose hairs. I have been throughout lockdown, but it's just a lot now. Like, especially with this macro lens, like it's, it's a lot. So this is the NADS nose wax kit for men and women. Nice and inclusive, thanks. Women have hairy noses too. So I think I need to microwave this stuff, but it's got these little like, what are these? spatula and a safe tip applicator. So I think I just put wax on this bit. So it's not gonna like get any of the hairs high up, which I know you're not supposed to do. I think it's just gonna get like, wait. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell no. Wait. Bloody hell, there's a lot of stuff going on here. So this is the little wax pot. It says remove seal before placing into microwave. Okay. What the hell is this? What are these? What? I don't, I don't understand. Okay. Thanks. So it says to heat this for two minutes in the microwave. So I'll go do that in a second. I think I then just have to stir it up. <gasps> okay, I think it's got a lot of pictures and it's got a lot of writing. I, I think I get the idea. Oh my God, you can put it over your nose. Do I need that? Okay, be right back. I'm gonna go microwave this and then I'm gonna shove it up my nose. Ah. Uh... I was just doing a little cutaway shot um, of the wax. And I got it all over my legs. This is why you read instructions. <sighs> I'm just gonna let it cool at this point, I think. Hi guys. That looks really dodgy, doesn't it? Okay, I'm gonna give this a little stir. So basically what I have to do is I get my little thing and dip that right in there. And then it says to give it a little twist. I feel like the wax is maybe too hot. I'm gonna wipe off that little edge bit there. Okay. So I'm going to, I've got to do that. And do. Right. It's just to leave it there for no more than two minutes. So while I wait, I'm just gonna peel this, um, what once was hot wax, that's now cold wax, off of my hand. Ta da! Multitasking, baby. How long's that been? I don't even know. Should I like double time it? I mean, I'm probably not gonna do too many videos like this. So while I have you and while I have you with the macro, I'm just gonna show you my nostril hair, okay? So you maybe can't see too much, but there's a whole lot of stuff going on up there. I'm gonna do this one now as well. I probably shouldn't do them at the same time, should I? Probably shouldn't. But yeah, here I am. I'm just, I'm carrying on. Okay, twisty, twisty, like that. Oh, okay, so this is pretty cool. Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to do that at the same time, am I? Right, ready? Uh, how do I pull it off? Oh, it says don't leave it on for more than two minutes, and I definitely have. Okay, it says just pull down in one swift movement. Ready? Ready? I can't do it, I can't do it. Oh! <laughs> I mean, it's, oh my God. This is, <laughs> oh my God. I'm gonna do that all the time. Okay, it looks like I've got bogeys in my nose now because I've got a little bit of wax left on my nose ring, but holy shit. I'm just gonna show you on the macro. This is like, this is the thumbnail. That is so disgusting, but so great. Okay, round two. It's actually not even that painful. Like, there's a little bit of obviously tugging and like, it's more painful than not doing it, but it's fine. It's just, I don't know, the whole act of it just seems so wrong. Right, ready? See, see, one. I can't do it, I'm scared. I can't do it. Ow. Oh my God, I feel like I can, I feel like I can breathe better. That one is, this one was actually even better than the last one. I am disgusting and I love it. I told you I had some hairs up there. Holy shit. Ollie, I kind of want to do it again. I kind of feel like I can get even more. Oh, there is definitely more in there. I need to like get it at the front bit. Oh, I like this. Okay, I'm gonna get some more of that wax. Yeah, I probably should have just waited until it cooled for a second because this seems a lot easier to use. And I'm gonna shove it like, right in that bit, in there, you know? Like, 
the little little crevice. It smells quite nice, which is good because I'd have to have it up my nose for a while. I'm gonna do one at a time. I have to go and show these to Ollie. Oh my God. I honestly want to keep them. Like I actually kind of love them so much. Like my children. Everyone's out there having quarantine babies. I'm there breastfeeding my nose hair. Okay, we're gonna try and get it in this bit, ready? <sighs> it's just a tug, it, it honestly doesn't even hurt that much. It's just scary. Okay, I missed it then. One, two, three. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Are you joking me? Are you joking me? Oh no. Oh no. What have I done? Oh, that's... Come on. I might just have to tug at that. It's just breaking! I guess this is why it says don't use it for more than two minutes. Oh, shit. Never thought I'd be like, picking up my nose like this on camera. Oh no, no. What, what did I do? I did something wrong here. <laughs> I can't get it out. <laughs> Shit. Spatula. Oh no. That's it now. This is my life forever. I'm just gonna have this thing stuck in my nose. <sighs> I'm gonna leave it for a second. I'm gonna do the other one. I'm gonna do this right. I'm gonna do this like a real professional, okay? That one. Get in there. So yeah, it says to do it for at least 60 seconds. So, okay, it's been about 60 seconds, so. Oh my God, I could do this all day. I need to like shove my tweezers or something up my nose. Look, ow. Oh, it's like fully wrapped itself around my nose ring as well. Oh, it's still pulling out hairs though. Okay, the actual process of doing it isn't painful, but if you fuck it up like I did, then it gets painful. Cause right now I'm just slowly pulling out all of my brow hairs one by one. <gasps> there we go. Now obviously you need to make sure you're doing it right, but Hell yes. Oh my God, I just want to do it more. One more time. Okay, you pulled my leg. Yeah, leave the wax to cool for a while. Longer than a minute. It says do it for a minute, but do it for longer. Okay, this bit, I want to get like right in there. Uh, okay. And then squish it down there, you know? Maybe this won't get stuck to my nose again. It does such a good job of it though. Ooh. And then again, this side. Spread those nostrils. Okay, so this one's got to come out any second. Ready? Oh. <laughs> oh no, I got some on my nose again. Okay, that was quite easy. I can seriously breathe easier through my nose. I obviously need to sort out my nose ring situation here, but I can genuinely breathe through my nose so much easier. Okay, now I'll do this one. Oh, I fully enjoyed every second of that. I will continue to use this on a regular basis. Very regular basis, because my nose hair grows back so fast. I'm then just gonna use one of the post-wax calming oil wipes, because maybe that'll be able to take off some of this shit. Let me just stick this up my nose quickly. Oh yeah. I actually don't know how I'm gonna get all of that wax off my nose ring, to be honest with you. Let's give it a little scrub for a minute. Is it just me, or are my eyebrows getting darker? <sighs> Honestly, that is a game changer. Like I said, I've had my nostrils waxed twice in the past. This is definitely the best my nostrils have looked all lockdown though. Like they are hair free, baby. Oh, I got wax on my clothes and <laughs> my phone. Oh, for God's sake. So now it's time to tint my lashes to complete the look. Although like, I don't really look any different to when I first started this video. I'm just in a little bit more pain. So next I'm gonna be tinting my lashes using this eye look kit. It's called the Lash Tint Permanent Tint for Lashes and I got it in black. Rin it says rinse immediately if product comes into contact with eyes. Well, I'm putting it on my eyelashes, so. So it comes with these three products here. You've just got a regular spoolie. I have a activating gel and then a developer gel. So basically the same kind of stuff as this here. Okay, so this one seems to be a little bit different. I think you use them separately. So you've got step one, the activating gel, coat the brush thinly, apply to the lashes, and then leave for a minimum of two minutes, but no more than eight minutes. Okay. So I'm just gonna put some of that in here. This is the one thing I'm kind of reading the instructions for because I don't wanna lose my eyes. Apply to lashes, coat them well, and leave, yeah. So literally just kind of like apply it like mascara, I guess. I'm just gonna squiggle that around there. And then I'm gonna pop that on my lashes. 
It says to make sure that they're coated well. So I'm gonna do that. I might not do my bottom lashes. My bottom lashes are quite long and when I tint them, they can look a little bit crazy sometimes. So yeah, I might just tint my top ones. And I'm gonna make sure I get right into those little ones here. So then I'll do the same on the other eye. Okay, so I'm just gonna set an alarm for five minutes. I've set an alarm for 6.02. Thanks, Beach. Guys, my alarm's going off and I'd like to show it to you. Good morning, beautiful. It's time to wake up. Rise and shine. Wake up, beautiful. <laughs> it's time to get up. Ollie hates it. I love it. It wakes me up every morning and I wake up and I'm like, thank you. So it says, using a cotton pad, remove the activating gel from your lash by folding the pad in half and closing the lashes in between the sides with your fingers and very gently pulling away. All right, go back. So I'm just gonna just wipe all that off, I guess. It says to like remove the residue, but there's not really anything on my lashes right now. Like, yeah, it doesn't really feel like much. So then it says to use the developer gel, take the well clean mascara wand and thinly coat in the gel, apply to lashes, coat them as well as before, and then leave on for no more than four minutes. So I'm gonna take this one, oh my God, and just glob some of that there. And then I'm just gonna coat that mascara wand. And then just brush that through. Ooh, why does this burn? Ow, ouch, Charlie. Do I continue or what? It burns. Do I just keep my eyes shut or what? Maybe I do. Oh my God, why does this burn so much? Why the fuck does this burn so much? Let's continue. No pain, no gain, am I right, ladies? Am I right? Fine, until I open my eyes. So as long as I don't open my eyes, I'm fine. Fine, out, fine, okay? That one's not so bad. I feel like I've kind of gotten used to the burning now. Okay, so now I'll wait for what, like four minutes? I'm just gonna clean myself up a little bit underneath my eyes and on my lid. That should do it. I mean, it looks all right. Okay, it's been just over five minutes, so now... I just do the cotton pad thing, don't I? Yeah, it doesn't burn anymore, which is good. That's always good. It's nice to not have burning eyeballs. But yeah, I'm just gonna pull that off. Hmm. It's definitely done something. I mean, I wouldn't say it's made a crazy difference, but it's definitely done something. I think I did a pretty good job. It's not overly noticeable, but it's done something. And then just because it's satisfying and because I just love doing it, I'm just gonna shave my eyebrows. Like this bit here. I'm just gonna shave around where I dyed it. Are we done? I think we're done. So guys, this is the finished look. I don't really think I look any different, to be quite honest. My brows are a little bit more slug-like <laughs> and I can breathe a little bit better through my nose, which is fun. Uh, yeah, there's no real like ending to this video. There's no real start, middle and end. I put some stuff on my face. I came out with it, still with a face, um, just with slightly darker brows, slightly tinted lashes, no nose hair, and then a slight little wax burn on my upper lip and hand and leg. I'm just gonna sit here and finish my lovely Coca-Cola and just marvel at all of the hair that was in my nostril. No wonder I couldn't breathe, man. I had like an entire hedgehog up my nose. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, I don't know what it was, but if you did happen to enjoy it, please do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you do wanna see more of me because I upload all the damn time. But apart from that, that is it from me. I love you guys and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Unless all of this decides to give me a delayed reaction and my eyeballs burn out. But otherwise, see you later.